My last name is Sezewa. Uh, people find it difficult to pronounce that. So I said, just make it easy and come easy. My job is to teach them well and Jesus is a great teacher. I like his teaching style. He really, uh, he really wants you to learn. He pours his heart into the program. I do a lot of one-on-one. -on -one. What's up, Daddy? What's up, kid? Let me see what's going on there. He'll come weld with us. Got a pause on the sides there. I want to make sure that um, they get the principal side of welding and the application side of welding. Right now we're learning trigonometry. We'll have different subjects. A couple weeks ago we were learning about metallurgy and he wants us not only to be, have the skills to weld, but to understand the process of what's going on. What we're trained here is to teach guys to become uh, welders, certified welders. The certifications are not just a state certified, they're American Welding Society, world recognized certifications. Anywhere I go, I'll be able to find work. That uh, gives me a lot of confidence in knowing that I'm going to have a, a better life for myself when I get out. I got a lot of certifications that, I, that I've got since I've been down, so I'm pretty confident I'm going to get a job. The future is the sky's the limit. We end up going to Power Driving Union in Pittsburgh. All these are letters from former students. She just keep coming and keep coming. This letter here shows he's making 34 an hour. This is a pay stop from one of them. He said the job is going fine. I am still building the mall out in Fremont. I will never, ever go back. I think we're making some impact on these lives, and that's worth it for me. If I can see one of them go home and grab a job, I'm happy. If you give a man a skill set like this here, he'll have a, a decent paycheck. He won't want to return to where he was at. They are predicting that in the next four years, there'll be shortage of welders in the US, and then we will have no choice but to import welders from overseas. It's expensive. It's an expensive program. But you know, I think it's an investment. This is genuinely an investment in the future of rehabilitation. Men get this, they come in here, and within a couple years' time, they've gone from being this way to, I think, a pretty good leg up on getting back in society and being successful.